afternoon. Um, it's been a while, but thank you for enjoying the silent vlogs. Um, I wasn't sure how you guys would receive them. I don't know if uh, you liked them, but it's nice that you guys, some of you did mention that you did like it because maybe it's a nice break from all the talking. And um, so from now on, I think I'll sprinkle in a few here and there. Just I'll go with the flow. If I don't really feel like talking a particular week, then I feel better knowing that silent vlogs are okay with you guys as well. But anyway, I thought I would make this one a little bit of a ramble. Um, I just wanted to update you guys. I've got my jasmine tea here. I just got it today. Um, I finally finished the cricket. Uh, the cricket. Oh my god. I finally finished the circle stickers. Um, and I was having a lot of problems with the cricket, cricket cutting it properly because um, cricket. But also the bleed was a bit too thin. So the problem is I really like having a really thin outline for the stickers because it just looks nicer as a sticker sheet. Like I could make the bleed really, really big and then I wouldn't really get any errors, but I tried to like make it as small as possible, which was kind of fine for the first three colors. So these ones turned out okay. But then that last one, this one kept cutting off center and I was just having so many problems with it. So I ended up just increasing the bleed a little bit more just a few more millimeters and it's still like right on the edge but it's fine because then that means the circle like you can actually use the complete circle instead of getting some white around it so sometimes you just have to increase the bleed a little bit more so this is um the four colors i really like them but i'm just a bit concerned that these are similar but i can't bring myself to take out one of them because when i take out one of them it feels empty i feel like i'm missing a color and i guess i just it's different enough, I don't know. But anyway, so I don't know if I mentioned, but these will be sold separately, but also as a set to give you more of an option, um, I guess with stickers. And I'm still on the fence about whether I want to do neutrals or not, but I think some gray ones would be nice. That's kind of the first color I'm thinking of with the neutrals and I haven't figured out what other colors yet. So I'm not gonna do any of the neutrals yet. I just want to get that up so I'm going to try and take photos today but right now I actually need to record the podcast for my patrons and I really wanted to finish my cozy home stickers that you saw me working on yesterday um but I was taking so long with it this is what I've got so far the jumper of the um the color of the jumper is wrong but that's what I've got so far that's terrible I can't really show you properly I've changed some of them I've updated some of you see the coffee cup looks a bit different instead of the sunflower um, in the vase I've just made it a sunflower sticker I'm trying to think more about what I would actually stick in my planner and the size of them that way because I found the other cozy home stickers uh, some of them were too small and some of them were too big so I'm just kind of rethinking that but as you can see I've only done half this half is not done yet so I probably won't get around to doing that today but I think maybe I'll finish it tomorrow or just sometime this week but I'm gonna do the podcast and then I'm gonna work on the second part of the commission which is to make Instagram gifts and I think that's mostly it for today I'm sorry the camera is really low you're stacked on about three books and a thick pad of post-it notes and you're still too low but I'm trying to find my to-do list yeah so basically if I can record the podcast photograph the circle stickers um, and work on the commission then that is a good day I've been trying to catch up um, like I mentioned I've been feeling a little bit overwhelmed but that's completely my bad um, and just something I've realized that I do is that when I feel overwhelmed, I tend to put important things, I, I tend to put it off, even though because I feel overwhelmed, I should really be prioritizing those tasks. And, um, I'm realizing that now. So I think because I'm kind of scared of the big tasks or just a little bit worried about it that I kind of just keep putting it off. But by putting it off, I get more and more stressed because I'm not actually addressing the real issue. So a tip <laughs> if you're feeling overwhelmed is to 
just really prioritize the actual task that's making you stressed. One last thing, um, I need to talk about this book, but the camera is resting on the book. <laughs> okay, I have been reading this book and I'm almost done. I've got this much left, but then not really because this is actually a lot of acknowledgements. Okay, so I've got this much left. Um, which could be easily done in a read. This is a great book and it is super easy to read and understand especially for beginners and while it talks a lot about race, uh, racial issues in America I feel like it's still super relevant for anyone to understand the issues of not just black people but also people of colour. She does address a few issues. This book isn't super detailed and informative. It doesn't go very deep into issues but it is still a great read and I think important. There's a lot of her personal stories as well so it's it's easy to understand from an emotional level if that makes sense. So if you're interested I do highly recommend this. I have so many underlined, really badly underlined um, words. I can't draw a straight line to save my life. Like honestly, I can't. But even in Procreate, I really struggle to draw straight lines. And I don't want to use the straight line feature where you hold down and it creates an instant straight line. Because I still like the kind of organic imperfections of a naturally drawn straight line. But then my straight lines are just not straight at all. You can get an ebook as well if you don't want to um, buy the physical copy. I felt like this was an important book so I wanted to buy the physical copy so I could like underline the heck out of it and reread it. Um, so very happy I read this book and I can't wait to keep learning more because this felt like a really good introduction and then I want to get deeper into the topic. So it's just kind of an overall kind of covering about systemic racism and how it affects black people personally. So um, this is super great if you feel like you're a beginner, you don't know much about the topics, this is kind of just a really good introduction. That's it for the update. I will try to check in with you guys again uh, soon, later this week. But right now, I need to do the podcast. Okay. Bye guys. Saturday. This morning I, at 10 a.m., that doesn't matter to you. Anyway, this morning I just finished doing a live stream with my patrons and we played, me and Sherry played um, some Minecraft for two hours and that was really fun. Um, and she got killed by an Enderman, so it, it escalated very, very quickly, but that was really, really fun. Um, I'd love to do that more often, but I don't think I can handle it, right? at this moment so that is a plan for the future I'd love to do maybe um fortnightly live streams just playing all we do is just play games and listen to music um so it's super chill and fun but right now I am making some instant noodles because <laughs> I'm hungry and it's lunchtime and Kevin's not here so uh we don't have any leftovers actually we do have some leftovers but I'm just gonna make some noodles because I love instant noodles it's really really bad for you but I do throw in some veggies and dumplings and kimchi so not as bad but today is going to be a boring day to film because I just need to edit some photos and I'm not going to show you because they're photos of me <laughs> I'm, I might show you some when I'm done but this week has been really boring to film as well I'm so sorry but I am getting through a lot of the deadline the tasks with deadlines so hopefully next week I say this every week but hopefully next week will be a little bit more interesting I mean, I mean, that's fine. I don't mind that it's not interesting. I just wanted to let you know. It's just, um, I think it's good that some weeks are boring because it kind of shows you that not everything in business is glamorous and fun. 
you're not making new products all the time you're kind of just trying to keep up with running the business so that is reality there's not always things that I can film but hopefully you're not watching this for something exciting you're just kind of watching this to maybe learn more about starting your own business um, I still haven't finished the cozy home stickers I'm about halfway through and I don't know how I feel about it I feel like it's too different to the original now and I don't know I kind of like the original the theme of the original more but I, I think I'm going to I mean they're the same theme I just mean like the color scheme of it but I'm going to keep going and see how I feel at the end of it so that's what I've got so far and it's pretty different I think it's because it's just a lot more colorful but I will try to finish that and see what else needs to be changed because so far it's not really turning out how I wanted. I really like the groceries bag but I feel like there's just so much color in there. Maybe I need to get rid of the purple or change the onion. I really like red onion. I was trying to make it accurate. Um, I personally love red onion but I might have to change it to just a normal like brown one to keep with the consistent color scheme and maybe get rid of the eggplant even though I love eggplant as well. I don't know. We'll see. Um, maybe it's just going to be a colorful cozy home but it doesn't look as cozy because there's so many colors now. I like this side of it. That, that side looks kind of cozy. It's just when you start to add in the rest. I don't know. I don't know how it feels. So I'm just going to keep going. Maybe try to work on that tomorrow because today is photo editing day and um, I still need to I already took photos of the circle stickers but I still need to edit them so that is also on the list let me see what else I also forgot to tell you guys that I ordered new vinyl stickers I didn't film myself making it it was really simple but I was just kind of working it up on it in my own time I didn't know what was what it was going to turn out to be like but let me show you. It's a simple little rainbow guy. And he looks like that. So I've already ordered those. And they should be coming in two weeks. In less than two weeks now. So that's pretty exciting. So all of my patrons will get that mailed out to them. But it will also be up in my shop as well. So I'm pretty excited for that. Because it's been a while since I've had a new vinyl sticker, I've only got two designs and I need to redo the boba one as well because that was like one of the first things I ever made and looking back at it now I'm like that's not really my style anymore and it's still really cute and I'm still really proud of it but I definitely need to update it a little bit. I don't know if I want to make him not milk tea and just a boba tea so maybe just green tea for like my vegans or my non dairy drinking friends, my lactose intolerant friends. Um, so that's about it. I think this might be the last time I talk to you guys this week. Again, thank you so much for saying that you guys like the silent vlog. That does ease off some pressure for me. Um, I was also worried that it was really short that you guys wouldn't like it. But I think short vlogs are good as well, just to give you guys a break because I've been uploading like 30 minute vlogs and that's, that's a commitment. That is a serious commitment to watch a 30 minute vlog. So. I'll try to mix it up from now on. I'll just go with the flow. I'm not really going to be that intentional about it. Um, I'll just document my week and see what comes naturally. I think I'm just overthinking it. it. This is the problem when you get, when you make some sort of progress towards something. In the beginning, you're kind of hesitant. Then when you start, you're kind of carefree. And then you slowly get to a point as you get more and more knowledge or more and more experience, you start to kind of second guess yourself. And I think I'm at this point right now but I'm trying not to overthink it so that's it for today um the live stream was so much fun <laughs> that was really good uh, so that sets a really good tone for the rest of the day I'm gonna eat edit some photos maybe work on the cozy home stickers but maybe off camera I'm not sure depending how I feel but I might see you tomorrow I might not but that's all for today okay time to eat bye guys where everything is like super quiet Saturday.